Run the code online or download from codegive.com, link in the description below. Sure, here's a tutorial on how to install pip for Python on Windows along with some code examples. PIP is a package management system used to install and manage software packages written in Python. It's a powerful tool for managing Python libraries and dependencies. Here's how to install PIP on Windows. First, you need to download and install Python on your Windows machine if you haven't already. You can download the latest version of Python from the official website at python.org. After installing Python, you need to make sure it's added to your system's path. You can check this by opening a command prompt and typing. If Python is installed and added to path correctly, this command should display the installed Python version. PIP is usually included with Python distributions starting from Python 3.4 onwards. However, if your Python distribution doesn't include PIP or you want to ensure you have the latest version, you can download get-pip.py from get-pip.py. To install PIP, you'll need to run command prompt as an administrator. You can do this by searching for command prompt in the Windows Start menu, right-clicking on it, and selecting Run as Administrator. Navigate to the directory where you downloaded get-pip.py using the cd command in command prompt. Once you're in the directory containing get-pip.py, run the following command. This command will run the Python script get-pip.py and install pip on your system. To verify that pip has been installed successfully, you can run the following command in command prompt. This command should display the installed pip version. Now that pip is installed, you can use it to install Python packages. For example, to install the requests package, you can use the following command. This command will download and install the requests package and its dependencies from the Python package index, PyPI. Here's a simple Python code example that uses the requests library installed with pip to make a GET request to a URL. This code sends a GET request to https colon slash slash api.example.com slash data and prints the response data if the request is successful. That's it. You've successfully installed pip for Python on Windows and learned how to use it to install packages and manage dependencies. Happy coding. Chat GPT.